watching them as we have for the last near decade and not taking it for granted either because of what Hawks hockey was before they showed up and and how much of a non-starter it was. And any time we talked hockey, it was to mess around with the hockey folks, you know, poke the 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 five thousand or so that was still <laughs> <laughs> right, right, that was that was still going to the UC at Chicago <laughs> Stadium yeah. back in the day. But th- these two guys now, and think about it too, Although, transformed, transformed. A, not not just a hockey brand, but a national sports brand. Okay, can I can I just for the sake of being a, a devil's advocate here? I thought you were going to use another D word, but go ahead. Well, I could be that too. <laughs> so it would would if Duncan Keith were to say, well, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on here. If he were to walk in and say, wait I'm a second. I'm going to tell you exactly what I said to Duncan. Go ahead. Right. But, but if, if Duncan <laughs> Keith said, well, how come I don't even get a sniff here? Hey. Because if I've been the guy who's who's sort of backstopped the whole thing and hey. leading the team in minutes hey. and all of it. Sit your ass over there. Talking about Kane and Taves right Okay, now. what if I quote, no, Mu- no, no, I go no. quote Mussolini again? <laughs> no. Yeah, yeah, we love it. <laughs> Nobody's day. I understand okay. you and all your Norris trophies and, and, and your Hall of Fame career. Go sit over there. We're talking about Kane and Taves. Okay. They don't know, no one says Keith and Kane. No one says Taves and Keith. You say Kane and Taves or Taves and Kane. They don't play no games. Fine. You know, you're not on the McDonald's commercial, okay? You're too busy doing other things. What if I'm in a Tim Hartons commercial? <laughs> Can I do that? Uh, that'd be okay, hey. <laughs> no, I'm just saying they, these two guys transformed what we thought of a of a of a a sports franchise that was ranked one of the worst in all of sports. What if I do a commercial for a walleye lure, <laughs> <laughs> like what a like yeah, a rapala? Not gonna stop, are you? Hi, this is Duncan Keith for the <laughs> countdown rapala. It's throw it out there and it. F- Catch fish with it, eh? Where's the wisdom? Yeah, you let it drop down about 10 feet and you kind of do a slow retrieve on it, eh? You pull that thing in and oh, you're an sometimes idiot. a smallie will hit it too, eh? Sometimes even a northern will grab it for you. But you never know. Anyway, that's all I have to say <laughs> for today about the sinking Rapala. Comes you're from thinking the game like, you know what? Okay, see ya. Yeah, you don't know fishing either, little lady. I bet you couldn't come out with us. So you'd be oh, trying well. to catch walleye with a daredevil spoon, eh? <laughs> this completes my commercial for the lures. I'll do another one another time. Talk about the beetle spin or something. <laughs> you are an absolute idiot. You know that? It's the Bernstein and Cough Show. You're listening to 670 I never know what I'm going to say.